Well, here we are in Kentucky, KCA 2009, and it's so exciting. Tom, we'll talk about how you almost broke your toe at Hooters in Norfolk. How's that? Yeah! Let's do it. It's creepy when you say that. Well, the only time, my other, my other connection with them is the only time I ever skipped school. I was not at my school, I was at Woody's school. So I went on this with my guy, and Woody's in that class, and so I sat with Woody and just cut up and class. So They make that sound on the phone. I'm I'm Public speaking will have nothing to do with that fact. Get out of here. It's like Denise went there. That's a great story. I just couldn't. And then after the book, I was like, Clearly the answer is no. No. He thought a lot about his side of that whole thing, and he had not given any thought to have a Well, how does one of you see a story like this? What is this? Did this happen recently? No, no, no. This is a fire alarm. Should they be charged criminally, etc.? Even that fire in California, you know, there's the issue who said it. So what newspapers do is they set the agenda and they give you the, ideally, they give you multiple perspectives. And when newspapers in their current form are gone, and I'm, you know, environmentally they're a disaster. I mean, I'm good with the fact that they take up newspapers and when we're done, we vote, I'm good. But the problem is I don't know how many of us who are getting older are going to transition to, I'm reading the newspaper. I don't, I don't know that I could even handle that. And what I'm concerned with and have been for years is, is their lack of basic knowledge. I mean, when you have a student who stands up and we do a question of the day in my classes every day, and I said, how do you feel about the war in Iraq? And you have a concern, this was several years ago, do you have any concern about the draft being reinstituted? And her response was, we're at war in Iraq? I didn't know anything about it. Now, even there, my students are like, daggers are looking at her. They're like, what planet did you just come from? And in
I know exactly, I've got my uh, workspace downstairs. I'll put it, hang it right where I am. Well, you still have your office downstairs, right? Yeah. So I'll just put it down. Uh, I've got a clock space. I had an Obama clock, and it doesn't work. And there's something wrong with it. Uh -huh. Oh, wait, where do you, where do you work anyways? Hey, Get a shot. what is this? Wait a minute. It sounds okay. Like what, this is what happens when you get tenure right here. That is. <laughs> well, she's been a dean and everything else, so I'm. Oh, uh oh. This was a, a Valentine's Day present. Wow. wow. Golly. It's been Twenty years. Wow. Well, I'm gonna say yeah, because it, he has twenty years worth of payments. Oh, no. no. Now is his name Todd? My husband's name Todd. Yeah, because there's not oh, that Sarah yeah. Palin. Oh, husband you're referring name? to the yeah. person who got out of the car. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Um, we got it on eBay. Oh, good. For you. Good deal. Oh, that's Looks nice. Car. Looks great. Well, my town car isn't nice. brand new. When you drive by, look on the left, you'll notice I put the vein in the vanity plate because it's right there on the yeah, left. Yeah, he's got that. The silver town car. Just look for just look for my last name. It's very easy to spot. Okay. Oh, well, you guys Goodbye. take it easy. All right. Okay. Well, we're going to roll it. Here you go. Shake hands. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Well, shake hands quick. Shake. All right, oh. come back. So we got to go. All right, you take care. All right, you too. Drive carefully. Enjoy. Yeah. Actually, eight hours is not too bad because I only stopped once. So have a good trip back, Alice. Say hi to your pup for me. Over for. All right. Well, we roll. All right. See you later. Hey, roll down the window. Check on USC. Adios. Man, all these nice cars. There's Luz right there. Sports car. Must be nice. Yeah, there go Bobbin. Dan. Head for the hills. There's Alice. Shooting with her new flip phone. She's getting the front of the lodge and I'm just shooting in my direction. Gorgeous view near sundown.
Now the trick is hiking back up the hill to get to the lodge. No sidewalk that I see. The lodge at sundown. And here is an alternative path down to the water. Looks suspiciously like some type of weekend dinner cruise on the lake. Possibly the same thing they do at Hot Springs on Lake Hamilton. So that's it, KCA 2009.